Hi, this is Kath King from Seeking Health and today I'd like to talk to you about how to tell if your diet is working for you. There's so much diet, nutrition and health dogma and hype out there telling you the one best way to eat for health and longevity. Who do you believe and how do you know if you're paleo, vegan, raw, high carb, low carb, whatever diet is actually working for you? Well, one way is to just go by how you feel. Do you have any symptoms of less than perfect health? Do you catch colds, get headaches, um, have low energy, feel depressed? Are you on medication for any conditions? Or do you experience perfect health all the time with high energy levels every day and maintaining your perfect weight? While answering these questions is a great starting point in figuring out if your diet is working for you, it's also very subjective and it focuses on just your current health. It can't predict what your health will be like tomorrow when any mistakes you're making with your diet today finally catch you up. And it can often take time for nutritional errors to show up in your health. So any symptom of less than perfect health has occurred because you've been doing something wrong for long enough that your body simply can't cover for you anymore. So in addition to considering how you currently feel, there is an objective, scientific, accurate way to measure whether your diet and lifestyle is working for you, and that's blood testing. Now blood tests are a fantastic tool to help you really know if what you're doing is working, and the results can't be argued with. If your results aren't optimal, then your current nutritional protocol is not working, no matter how convincing the guru is that told you that it would. And also remember that we're not actually what we eat, we're what we absorb and assimilate. So if you have digestive issues, your diet won't work for you, even if it is optimal, until you deal with the problem and help your digestive system to heal. Now blood tests are a really necessary tool whenever you have any kind of disease to help you figure out why you developed that condition and what you've been doing wrong. But they're also a valuable tool for preventative health. And I love prevention. It's so much more preferable and easier than having to cure something. And often problems show up in blood tests before you display any symptoms. And that allows you to head off any disease before your body is damaged. So I get blood tests every year to check that my nutrition is optimal and I always advise my clients to do the same. You can go to your doctor and ask them to order blood tests for you or you can get many blood tests done yourself without having to go through your doctor but I do recommend that you go through your doctor for your blood tests if possible because this ensures that they're kept informed of any possible problems and they can help you interpret the results of your tests. And also in New Zealand, there is the, going to the doctor is actually a much cheaper option because then all you have to pay for is one doctor's visit and the tests are usually free. But if your doctor's not open to um, ordering the blood tests that you want or to you pursuing a preventative model of health, then you either need to find a new doctor or you need to take your health into your own hands and order your own blood tests from places like Southern Community Laboratories. And if you need help reading your blood tests, or if you need help deciding which blood tests you need, um, a free discovery session with me by Skype, phone or in person can help. So don't guess, health and nutrition is not about faith, diet's not a religion, blood tests are a really valuable tool, use them.